in YouTube, I, um, just, uh, bought a new driver. I got a Nike VR Pro. Uh, actually, also, I got it last night. Um, I was in the store, I got, I was testing out three different drivers against each other, uh, Ping G20, Nike VRS, and Nike VR Pro. Um, so basically I was in the simulator, and I was just, like I couldn't decide, I had taken out the VRS just because it was really unforgiving for some reason, and then I went over to the launch monitor, and I was sitting at the launch monitor, and from the VRS to the VR Pro, my club head speed jumped 10 miles per hour, my ball speed went from, it was like 112 to 128, somewhere around there. I was in the high 120s, I remember that. Um, you know, my swing speed jumped from 75 to 85 when I switched drivers. Um, and both of them went about 235 on the launch monitor. Um, so, I then went and tried it out today at the range. Um, one thing I really have to point out, compression channel works amazing. It, um, when you hit one out of the bottom of the club, I did that quite a few times just because I was trying to decide between two tees, either a tee that was a little too low for me or a tee that was a little too high for me. And then when I hit it out of the bottom of the face, it feels exactly like a center strike. And it really just goes right out off the face. Um, so medium launch, I would say. Um, I have the straight fit set at the neutral, but in the flat. So it's the neutral flat right now. That's what I have it set at. Um, just because the neutral flat will get it up higher. And it will uh, have more of a fade bias because in the store it was going a little low for me. And then it was uh, drawing a little too much. So then when I got back, I used a straight fit adjustment. And I switched it to flat because it was in the neutral upright. Uh, yeah, I got this for $170. So that was nice and cheap. Really, uh, like it. Yeah, I'll do a review on it soon. The yeah, and that's about it. There's the Project X shaft. It's not a real Project X, but I've compared the specs. It's, uh, pretty similar to a real Project X. I have it in 5.5, just because they didn't have any in 5.0. The 5.5 feels pretty good to me. Uh, yeah, so if you're looking for a new driver, I would really go. I would really recommend this thing. Um, you'll just crush it every time. Um, and the bottom of the face, that's where I hit a lot of shots off of. And it just really heats up the bottom of the face. And instead of getting it to not come off the ground at all, it still launches pretty high and it's great. Um, yeah.